modern culture of subvertent gender, do you ever wonder why we've assigned one to nature? Would we so ruthlessly pillage Gaia if we called her father? It's a subtle linguistic shift that reveals the hidden dynamic, a rhetoric so embedded we never question it, instead let it unfettered reinforce the edifice of privilege. Dispositions of mysterious origin, inherited postures, no one told you that integrity solidifies in the stomach, that speaking the truth in calamity has the consequences of abandonment, of moral and respect. But there's calming in the instrumentation of those with integrity. It is the aftermath of calamity, after all. Stop me. I would rather be empty out and wallow in the hopes that something, just something, not less, anything, might remain. Thank you. The world ended and we played a deck of cards. Freckled cosmos like a poly painting. Snow falls in slow motion. The world is a museum. I don't own a broad brush, but I've let art hold my hand as we walk through my soul, a dark forest, where tree roots plunge deep into the earth. Art said, look into the soul's black box. There is the light you've been looking for. Thank you. Blossom was a pavement artist, painted the trees in concrete estates and sad precincts, painted the streets. Blossom was a fruit farmer, lived on the land, raised and nurtured saplings with an invisible hand. Think of Blossom as solar panels. When the weather turned and the seasons unraveled, Blossom was a weather vane. Old Jaguar parked under apple blossom tree becomes snow leopard. Woo!